Hi, good people. This is Deborah. Let me read the disclaimer. All information provided on this channel is for educational purposes only, and this channel does not promote or encourage misuse of the information. But remember, your thoughts and opinions are equally important in sharing our togetherness. I will use words not intended to offend people, but to describe my point of view and how I see things. Take what resonate with you and what does not resonate with you, put it on the shelf or throw it away. Now, I asked the question, are you seeing numbers like 111-222-333-444-555-666-777-888 and 999? Are you seeing those numbers? Do you know what those numbers mean? Now, when I start seeing these numbers, uh, I was led to the Bible, straight to the Bible. And then from the Bible, I put together uh, what these numbers mean to me from what I gather the numbers mean. Now, keep in mind, I did have a video up some time ago that talked about those numbers. But what happened was, as I was deleting uh, videos, that was one that I deleted. Actually, I wanted to do videos in, in my flip charts. I really, this is what I went to school for. And I'm, it's amazing to me to be able to see that I still have some of what I was taught. Okay, now I'm going to read from my notes. Uh, this is what's on the flip chart. Why do I see numbers like 111, 222-333-444-555-666-777-888-999? Repeated numbers is what they are. And they, they're, they repeat, like for me, I see them all the time. All right. Now, 111 for me, means new beginnings, manifestation, and alignment with your true purpose. 222 is balance, harmony, and partnership. 333 is creativity, growth, and spiritual awakening. 444 is stability, foundation, and protection. 555 means change, transformation, and adventure. 666, often misinterpreted as a negative number, but in numerology, it can signify a need for balance and refocusing on your goals. 777 is spiritual enlightenment, intuition, inner wisdom. 888 is abundance, success, financial prosperity. 999 completion ending and the start of a new cycle that means you're going to end something and start something else uh, many believe that seeing repeated numbers is a form of communication from the spiritual realm or spiritual guide now, psychological explanation, this is from the professions. Uh, their perspective is uh, seeing repeated numbers can result from a frequency illusion. This occur when you start noticing something more frequent after it has been brought to your attention. Your brain begins to filter information to highlight this pattern more often making it appear more regularly in your perception. Now, that's what the professions say, because I'm sure people go and talk to the professions about things that they see that is not normal for them. Now, in the cultural and personal significant, depending on the culture or personal, uh, these numbers hold specific significance or symbolism that is meaningful to you. Regardless of the interpretation, many people find comfort 
and guidance in these occurrences. If these numbers resonate with you, explore what they mean and consider how they relate to your current life circumstances and experience. Now, I see them all the time. And soon after, the intent comes to me what they mean. And sometimes it takes me to the Bible. Now, I'm going to put underneath this video uh, how you can just go into the numbers on the Internet and just go straight to whatever the scripture is saying. Sometimes I'm led that way and sometimes I'm not. Uh, this was a, uh, a one. I'm sure you, a lot of you already are aware of this and you probably already know this. But this is for people that do not know. Uh, you have to pay attention to the numbers because they're very significant to you getting. If you if you are one that uh, talks to the universe or meditate to the universe, well, the universe talks back to you in numbers. I know that to be a fact. Well, that's one way the universe talks to you. The universe also talks to some people down here. And what happens is you, you may say, well, shit, I, uh, how, come, how come the universe don't talk to me? The universe does talk to you. You just keep missing it. Uh, most people just work and they work and work and work. And it's hard for them to hear uh, what the spirit is saying to them. So what happens is then the most high will the most high mother or father would take it outside of you and have somebody else to tell it to you you may you may turn on youtube and then there's a tarot card reader saying exactly what you know only you knew and and the spirit in you knew what you said privately so you have to pay attention to things uh that's why you constantly hear me saying take what resonate what does not resonate put it on the shelf because you guys are busy and because you're busy you know if you come in from work and and you're you're, you're tired and so if you sit and watch any of my videos it may not even resonate with you and then you know it becomes something else to you but it's always good to to look at my videos when you're relaxed because otherwise you probably won't get it. Uh, but anyway, hopefully you do. Um, but that's all I wanted to say at this point. So have a good one, guys.